Welcome back to my channel guys. Today we're doing another tutorial. This is not like the other video, the Easy AF tutorial to get you out the door. This one you gotta take your time. There's steps on steps. Go grab your palettes, go grab a drink if you're parched. Please grab your bliss eggs. We don't need no crusty lips on this channel. Just saying. And stay tuned to watch how I got this look. jumping right into it we're not wasting any time because this is not like the last video there's some steps to this and this is not gonna be quick oh sidebar look at that good eyebrow day they cooperate in first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna set our lids I don't use a primer or a base or whatever I use my concealer my shape tape and I'm gonna go in just with a little bit blend that in then I'm just gonna set it with my cover effects powder and translucent light you can use any powder you can use any concealer you can go ahead and use an actual primer I do not doesn't really make a difference and you use what the fuck you got I also we're gonna use colors <laughs> we're gonna use some colors today you don't have to use a white concealer to make these colors pop. You just have to have a good base down. And that's real shit. Don't let them sell you that white concealer just because you think. I mean, it'll definitely make your colors pop. It's not needed. It's really not necessary. So I'm just going to go ahead and blend this shit out. And set this shit up. Yeah. Alright, moving right along. We're jumping right into this Zulu by Juvie's Place. We're going right in for that yellow. Ooh, and I love a good yellow. Right now for the pink, now that the yellow is on, I'm gonna go back in with this petite crease brush. I'm actually just gonna use my off the color switch because I really just want this brush. I'm gonna pick up that pink. Now this pink is, it's really, it's a good pink. It's kind of soft to be honest. If you really want a pink that pops, you can go in with that BH Day and Night palette. And I might, we're just going to see first how it looks. We're just going to put that right in the crease. And we're going to bring it up a little. Again, this is my favorite way to make an orange. Just use the pink. But we also want that pink to pop. So I'm just going to blend this in and keep building it up you can already start to see that it's the orange in the crease and that's what we want that's exactly what we want that orange i mean you really could just go in with an orange to start that's completely up to you but i do like the gradient that it builds oh, so cute. i'm just gonna go back in with more of that pink and pack it on and we'll see if we need that bh pink because that it's like a hot pink beach and it's really pigmented and it stains <laughs> it does we're not gonna lie we're not gonna play games we tell the truth right here it does stain but it really is a beautiful pink and it's hella pigmented so i'm just gonna keep building this up and go in the other eye All right now that we're back we're blended we see the colors we see that yellow we see that pink and we see that orange that we made because we does this we're gonna go ahead and cut the crease and I usually do this off camera because it takes me forever, but we need to talk. We do. Because that Shane Dawson Jeffree Star launch, I'm a victim of that site crashing. Just, just please. I was so fucking mad. So mad. It was, I timed my break perfectly. I only get a 10 minute break, my first break, not my lunch. 10 minute break, timed it perfectly with the launch. And at one o'clock, Eastern Standard Time, which is 10 a.m. their time. Whew! It's like crash, crash, couldn't get on, couldn't get on, finally got on, put it in my cart. Error. Nice. That was cute. Error put it in my cart, and after maybe like, honestly, I'm gonna fuck this up talking to y'all. Of maybe like 30 minutes of putting it in my car and getting that stupid pink error box I said fuck it I tried Morphe 
was in line waiting for Morphe because that's how they did it. Like you put it in your car and then it's like there's a line to check out waiting. That was fine. I was like, okay, maybe there's hope here. Got a little hopeful. Doing my job, checking my phone. They told me not to refresh. I was following instructions. I was being good. Doing what I need to do, doing what they told me to do. Right? Wrong. All of a sudden, it's sold out. After 45 minutes of getting that, like waiting in line, don't refresh, a little more free. Right? I said, so fuck it. So fuck it. By this time, it's probably like 3 o'clock. I don't even know what the fuck time it is. No, when, when I got locked in Morphe, it was almost 2 o'clock. My time. So it had already been an hour since it actually launched. So I fuck it. I'll go back to Jeffrey Star's website. I finally got through. I go to I go check. I try to put it in my car and it says max is two. And I was like, two? I have shit in my car. I go to my car check. I'm like, uh-uh, I'm not paying for two. That shit's fifty two dollars. I'm broke. I tried to take one out, I tried to update my car, won't let me update the car. Gives me an error, backs out, just like crashes again. It's just, it was just ridiculous. And it was, it was really ridiculous because I was at work. I really didn't have time to be doing all this. I can't take breaks like I want to. It's not the kind of job that I have. It was so stressful. I'm trying at work, my cousin's trying at his house. My mother's trying for me at home. It was just, it was ridiculous. Like I've never had a launch like this. And I did have like the, for the restock for the um, Jaclyn Hill um, palette. I got the restock. It did give me some trouble. I'm not gonna lie. I was like on my break. I had like one of my employees, like a supervisor kind of took a tour to take my phone. Let me know when like it's in your cart. It was like, it was stressful, but this, I've never experienced a launch like this, ever. I would rather wait online for Jordans and not get them than to do this shit online. It was ridiculous. Go back to his site, get it in my car, then it's like in my car, try to check out, then it's like verifying. All right, what the fuck you need to verify? If there's more pallets, like that's fine. Verify it, then it goes proceed to it's like check out the Visa or Amazon Pay or like PayPal, something like that. So I go check out, error, lock me out, shut me out of the thing. All fucking day until like 3.30 and I was like, fuck it, I'm done. I'm done. I gave up. I was tired. I was annoyed. I was like, I'm just not going to get this palette. My cousin, she was on a flight. She was like, yeah, she was going to have her co-worker pick it up and get it for her. She was like, yeah, I'm just going to, I'm just going to wait for restock. I don't need that stress. And nobody needed that stress. Real fucking tea. It was bad. But you know what? My mother came through. Because when I got home, that mini palette was still on his site. Apparently, it didn't launch with the actual palette, which was nuts. Like, it was on, like, Beautylish, Beauty Bay, and Morphe site. The mini. But it wasn't on his site. So, I was able to get that. And, like, mom came through. She was like, go back. Throw that in there too. So I got actually got the blood sugar and the blue buff palette that I didn't get before that I really wanted. So you know what? I'm okay with that. And low key, low key, those colors in that mini palette, a little better than the main palette. I'm not gonna lie. If you fucking hear my dogs barking, please excuse them. They have zero behavior and they they don't give a fuck about my life. But don't say that to the, the black ones. He bite bite. He will bite you. So if you were a victim of this launch, just let me know. I'm here for you. Hashtag me too. Because this shit was ridiculous. Ridiculous. I'm so mad. Alright, I'm, I'm done ranting, but still. Still. <laughs> Alright, we cut the crease. Um, while it's still tacky, I'm just gonna use all this. I didn't even bring a napkin. Always forget something. I'm gonna go ahead. While it's still tacky, I'm just gonna take a flat brush. And directly on yeah, I fucked up. Okay, so if you fucked up like I did, and you had a little concealer, just go in with the brush, the eyeshadow, just go over it, just clean it up. It doesn't make a difference. Um, not perfect, and I don't give a fuck. Oh, again, while it's still tacky, I don't mind the concealer on my hand, mind your business. Let's take this flat brush, just gonna get in that yellow. And this is a really nice yellow. I fucking love this yellow. One of the best yellows I've ever used. I have my Sephora Pro Palette in Warm. There's a yellow in there. Uh, it's nice. But the 
this is it. So right from the inner corner, we're just gonna pack it on. And look at how I got it on my brush. Just to build that up. It's gonna be fallout everywhere. Just ignore that and pack it in. Honestly, you have to do both eyes at once because I have to see if they look the same. Um, I can't, I don't know, a lot of YouTubers do just do one and then they do the other off camera. I cannot do that because if something's not right, I'm going to be really mad if it doesn't look the same. Ooh, that yellow is on there, baby. Too, but I'm just gonna pack it all in. Just cover the concealer completely with that yellow. Okay, now that that yellow is packed on in, she's cute. She is. She's showing. She's popping. She's all that. I'm just gonna go back in with that BH Pink. What brush is this? But my crease brush, my petite crease brush, just because I want to just pack it back in there. It's right above the yellow, just to make sure that it shows. Be careful, you don't want to cover the yellow really. Maybe like open your eye a little wider and get on the outer corner. We're gonna go back in and blend that out as well. Just the cut crease, but you don't want it to, um, I mean, you can cut a bit, you can if you want. But for the outer corner, I always want to make sure that it's blended. So seamlessly. Then we go back in just with the make sure that pink is not all up in my yellow because we really want that yellow to pop. That's the fun show. I'm going to go back in with my blender brush. This is a Lux Crease Brush, a 228. I didn't put any no more product on that. Just go ahead and blend that out. Starting to see that sunset yet? No? Whatever. Just act like you do. What the fuck? Alright. I <laughs> know you probably guess. <laughs> He's probably like, what the fuck is wrong with that? But this is really me in my real life. This is really how I act. Anybody who knows me knows that this is not for YouTube. This is sad. This is me. Get rid of or get lost. And I really, let me just use this, okay, I have to. Let's just use this as a, just a clean powder brush because this fallout is getting out of hand. You really get out of hand. I'm just gonna go ahead and continue to blend that out just until I'm satisfied, until my hand hurts, until I can't blend no more. That's usually what I do. And as for the most part, the top, we are gonna go ahead and smudge out the bottom. Just want to make sure that this shit is really, really blended. We're blended. I'm satisfied for the most part. And all right, so we're looking good. We're looking cute. Um, but we're not done. We turn this shit all the way up, all the way up. I'm going to go ahead and grab my Stila glitter. This is in Smoky Storm. I'm just going to take some on my Is this the one that I want? <laughs> yeah, this is it. I'm going to take some on my hand. I think this is the one that looks more gold. So when that looks more gold, I'm going to take this angled brush. This is a fine liner brush, a 315. But you can just use any small brush, even a lip brush will do. But I'm going to go ahead and go over that crease outline. And this is my favorite brush to do because of the angle. I'm going to probably use this brush again. You'll see a little later because we turn in this look all the way up. We're not basic Bettys out here. That's not who we are. We're extra as fuck. Alright, so so we done. Let me just go ahead. And don't talk to me. You're distracting me. Damn. Alright, now that 
our glitters on, we pick it up and we like it. I'm just gonna go ahead and clean up underneath, um, do my base, my foundation, uh, my concealer. And once I start my concealer, I'm gonna come back and you know do underneath my eye. We're gonna smoke it out and we're gonna do the eyeliner. So be right back. Foundation's on, the concealer. I just go went ahead and use the Maybelline Fit Me and 334. This is um, Warm Sun. It's quick, just a matte. Foundation is cheap too, and I'm gonna find the Sephora. Also, cool. I'm gonna go ahead. Oh yeah, shit. I also set it with set my Tarte Shape Tape and Tan Sand with a banana powder. This is just to make it revolution one. Um, make sure it's, it's still there enough. Just powder to set, and also just to make sure. I want to go ahead and smoke up my under eye. I don't have that far on my foundation. I am going in with the BH Night and Day palette in that purple I was talking about. Girl, look at that purple. That's a that's a royal purple. I'm going in with my Zoeva smudger brush in 226. Ooh, I'm gonna smoke up the, the lower lash line. I should have done any eyeliner first, but I didn't because I was thinking I got too excited. But it's purple. That's gonna happen. And I just wanna make sure that it's clean. This purple is definitely pigmented. I'm just gonna bring it all the way to the front. Just smoke it out. I want some more of that purple. Just two. Let's make sure that purple is seen. There's really no purple on top, but it's cute. It's cute just to throw it off. It goes. And a little crazy with my concealer set, but fuck it. I'm doing like the Avatar, the last airbender, all up on my nose. And that's fine. Good show. Horrible movie. But we're not talking about it. We're not. Because I can go on for days. And now I'm almost satisfied with this purple underneath. For eyeliner. Oh, what is eyelash? It's quite on me. Eyelashes are out of control, by the way. I'm just going to go ahead and. Oof for my waterline just to really make it pop. And you guys can skip the step, you don't have to do it. You guys can be fine with the black, whatever you wanna do. I'm actually, which may not be safe, I'm gonna go in with my NYX Liquid Suede. This is in, what color is this? Life's a Beach, and it definitely is. Whew, if I can open it. I'm just gonna go in, just gonna put some right on my hand, and I'm gonna go ahead and take that fine liner brush. It's cleaned off. I did use some ice water. This is 315 Fine Line Brush by Zoe, but I'm actually gonna take some and go right in on my lower lash line, on my water line. Um, maybe get something that's eye safe. I don't care. It's really cute. And I do this a lot, like uh, the fucking blue one. Ugh. Be careful if you wear contacts when you're doing this, if you wanna actually follow my crazy ass. Because it does get on your contacts while it's still wet. So just be careful. But you can just wipe it off with um, just like a Kleenex. And I have fucking astigmatism, so my contacts are fucking huge. So you know they're annoying. And if they get on your lashes, don't worry about it. Um, you can just go ahead and just clean it up. I'm just gonna finish the other eye and <laughs> clean up my contacts. Now that the eyeliner is on, eyeliner, <laughs> it's liquid. On is good, I can see. We're all good. I'm just gonna go ahead and clean off. Boy. The banana powder. That's just for the mirror. I'm just gonna clean up the banana powder. Let me set my face. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just wing it out. I'm gonna throw some lashes off camera. Contour my face and just cut it up. I did a wing on camera. But get my mirror. I'm gonna use the Kat Von D tattoo liner. If you don't like her, well, if you canceled her, use any liquid liner that you want. 
really not an issue or you don't have to use liner at all you don't have to weigh it out i want to because i'm extra and that's what we're gonna do It's a lot easier to use liquid liner on matte eyeshadow. Like shimmers and glitters, it's it can be hit or miss. It can, it can skip, it look real patchy, but Don't distract me. Look, I want to always like hit or miss. It's like one side looks really good. The other side is a little special. We've been here, we've done. Eyeliner's good. Off camera, I'm just gonna go ahead and finish off this look. It was really just about the eyes today. I'm gonna go ahead, do my mascara, contour my face, highlight, throw in some lips. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm thinking either nude or purple. There's no in between for me right now. Then I'm gonna throw in these lashes. These, um, it's gonna be the um, Angel Style by Pretty and Mink. Follow them on Instagram, I'll link it down below. These are really fucking cute and they're really affordable and I really like them. They do have a thicker band, so if that's not something you're used to, it's something to consider, but you can definitely work with it either way. I'm just going to go ahead and finish the look and I'll show you guys how, how I tied it all together. I'll be right back. All right, this is the final look. Um, I just went ahead off camera, just put on my lashes, set my brows, I did my lips, I contoured, highlight, whatever. Did all that good stuff, but this is the final look. I, you know, had to fix it here. I was looking crazy. I was looking crazy. Just do some quick wand curls in there. The lipstick is just like a burgundy lip liner by NYX and like a nude lip. Figured I'd tone it down a little bit, but these eyelashes, ugh, oh, I fucking love them. These are the Angel Style by Printing and Beauty. Again, I'm gonna link it down below. Really affordable, really, really love them. And they have so many other styles, more dramatic than this. And this is like, this is dramatic for me. I think these might replace my Miami lashes by Lily lashes. Like this is like crazy. I fucking love it. And that's it. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. Go ahead and comment down below anything else that you'd like to see. Tell me where you stopped. Tell me if you were a victim by this launch. I need to know. And don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, notification bell so you're notified every time I upload. Right now we're uploading every Monday. Not. We're not playing on a schedule. We're on a road to 100 subscribers right now. At 100, we'll do the first giveaway. Right now, we have 30, and I appreciate everyone who subscribed, commented, liked, showed any love, shared it. I really do appreciate it. It really does mean a lot because people got to see how crazy we are and how crazy we get. And these popping ass look, because there's a lot of YouTubers on here. They're really cool, but it's boring. Sorry. Thanks again for watching, guys. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Wow. <sighs> Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. DM me anything that you want to see. There are definitely going to be unboxings coming. Definitely a boxy charm coming. My Jeffree Star unboxing. This is the first time I'm ever trying anything from this brand. I hear nothing but good things. Uh, fuck all the drama in the past. All the cancel what you want. I'm using these shadows and I'm going to fucking kill it. Again, comment what you want to see. DM. Thanks for watching, guys. Till next time.